Buy your kids a conventional keyboard, and here's what they'll learn on their own. For the same money, the Miracle Piano. If you haven't seen my other pickups video, you should check it out. But uh, I got a Miracle uh, piano at Goodwill for actually $4. Um, came with piano and some like generic crap stand or something like that. Um, works great. Turns on and everything. If I can get it on. Turns on. You can see it plays. Um, actually did not come with the game. But I actually picked up the game another time hoping that the piano was there but it wasn't so I mean I do have the game too but only problem is you find a lot of these things at Goodwill they're always missing you know cables and stuff and of course it's missing the uh, parallel the DB25 pin connector uh, so I'm actually gonna show you how to make one of those because it's actually not too hard so basically you're gonna want to get an NES controller and take apart the six screws in the back right here. Now you're going to want to take these five uh, colored wires and either cut them or desolder them or do whatever you want to do because you're going to have to, that's what you're going to have to use to your uh, DB25 pin connector you bought from Radio Shack or salvage from somewhere else. So when you're all finished, get the Miracle game popped into your NES, hook up your cable back to your Miracle piano, get it all turned on, turn on the NES, and hopefully it should work. Takes a couple seconds for the uh, game to actually boot up. hear that the sound's actually not even coming from the TV. I don't even have my uh, speakers turned on. It's coming through the Miracle Piano. So you got yourself a working Miracle Piano, especially if you can find it at Goodwill or something. So uh, happy hunting and thanks for watching.